Hey guys, Victoria Isla is part of the Creative 2 team, an online creative studio located in Arizona. Um, I'm, today I'm going to just go over one of the problems that I have. I have a really slow computer. I don't have a Mac and I have to work with what I have. Um, one of the problems that I have within Adobe Muse is that this, uh, you know, this simulator for the breakpoints, it's just so slow and it's just so choppy. It doesn't look as smooth as other people on YouTube, you know, you, you see their tutorials and it's super smooth. Well, mine's not smooth like that and it bothers the shit out of me. Maybe it's because I have OCD or something, but I don't like how choppy it is and I hate how crappy my computer can be sometimes with certain things and this is one of the problems I have and I'm gonna show you the solution right now. Um, this template, I downloaded it for free from, um, it's called musefree.com. They have free themes, free widgets. I'm going ahead and giving them credit for that uh, theme in this tutorial. So again, uh, what you would do, here's your solution. Press preview site in browser. You have it open, right? You have it open in your browser. You're, and I'm using Firefox specifically. My default browser is Firefox. Again, Firefox. So you click on this little hamburger menu out here. And it's going to open the menu, go over to developer, finally responsive design mode, and voila, you have an in-browser simulator uh, for your breakpoint. So if you're having a crappy experience um, with your computer and it looks really choppy and slow, right? It's a very slow response um, through Adobe Muse. You now have a simulator that's super smooth, check that out, within Firefox. Um, I know it's an extra step, but it saves you from having to upgrade your computer or having to buy a brand new computer um, overall. Um, and for me, this works fine. Um, again, it simulates the browser width or the breakpoints. And so I know I need a breakpoint here, uh, 1085 by 1280. And if I keep going down, I know where I would need my next breakpoint and then my next breakpoint after that uh, width this really cool free tool that you can use within Firefox. Uh, so I hope that this um, tutorial and trick uh, solution will help you in your wonderful designs. And thank you so much for watching another tutorial and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube. Okay guys, thank you.